What's poppin' homies? It's your boy Frozone coming at y'all with my first YouTube vlog. This is vlog one. And today we are talking about the Sola and Famous collab for Joe Atkinson's uh, 60 millimeter wheel. All right, so first impressions, this is my first time even rolling around on them. And they're really, really smooth and grippy as fuck. They're really, really grippy. That's first impressions. Um, yeah. See how I just like rolled up there without even trying? It's crazy. All right, so Famous, from what I know, is a rather new company. Uh, I just started hearing about them like, I wanna say, like it's been maybe about a, about a year or two, something like that. Um, and I think they're the first people to make an aggressive inline skate wheel with metal cores. Um, chromoly cores uh, is the exact metal that they're made of. And if you know anything about chromoly, it's supposed to be strong as fuck. All right, it's supposed to be really, really, really strong. But Famous has a bit of a reputation for having cores that bend and break. So I don't know. I don't know if they've always been made out of chromoly. But chromoly ain't supposed to break. You know, not on some rollerblades. Unless you jump off a fucking house or something, or you gotta be doing some crazy shit to break chromoly or bend chromoly. So, at first, uh, it, it, they changed the design. So at first they were doing like this three, three spoke, like three dual spoke thing, and they were kind of curved. And at first glance, when you look at that design, it doesn't look like those are strong at all. Like, whatsoever. Because, I mean, why put bent spokes in them? Versus these ones, these ones have more spokes and the spokes are straight. It's like, if you're into cars, like, these wheels kinda, they look like work wheels. Whoa. But yeah, they're really, really solid, like, right now. Like, I like them. I like them a lot. I really like them. Will they withstand the test of time? We just gonna have to see, you know? Uh, set slides ain't gonna be that easy, I tell you that much. But, uh, yeah, I feel like that's enough. I th that's enough talking about them. Let's get to the nitty gritty and uh, put them to work, you know what I'm saying? Let's do this. Overall, bro, I think they were worth it. Um, it's going to take a lot of getting used to as far as how grippy they are because they grip so good to where it feels like you're riding any rock. It feels like you only got four wheels on the ground. So that's gonna take some getting used to. Wheels might need to be broken in a little bit. I don't know. We're just gonna have to see. All right, y'all. So uh, this is day two of me sessioning the famous wheels. And um, I hadn't started skating yet, so I decided that I would, you know, inspect the wheels to see how how they did after the session yesterday and let me flip y'all around they fared pretty well you could tell that it's not going to be a very long lasting wheel because uh how soft the compound is um if i had any criticism for them i would ask that they made a harder wheel you know the 88a is cool but this is literally the softest 88A I've like ever ridden. But uh, no dents. Uh, that's a good thing. And uh, I already looked at the other one. You can tell that the uh, the edge of the rims are going to get pretty goofed up. And as the wheel wears down, you're definitely going to be riding on those in hard turning situations. Whether you're carving a bowl or whatever. Which could lead to you eating shit but you know that's neither here nor there
I really don't know how to feel about them completely just yet. But I can I can say that it's a pretty decent wheel for the park. But I'm about to take them to the indoor and skate on wood with them and see how they fare there. And uh, yeah, I'll holler back at y'all when I get there. All right, homies. So today we're at Society Memphis, which is an indoor skate park here. And uh, right away, still really, really, really grippy. Uh, the skate park is dusty and you don't, you don't feel none of that. So definitely a great wheel for indoor parks. You got a bunch of parks near you or you skate a bunch of wood, these wheels are for you. I mean, they're really grippy, bro. Like, it's insane how grippy they are. And really fast also. Really, really fast. And also, being that the cores are made out of chromoly, like when you land, you feel that, like you feel that in your heels, you feel it in your back. It hurts, but of course, the wood takes away from that a little bit. So it pleasants out the ride more when you're skating around on wood. So I definitely 10 out of 10 recommend if you're a hardcore park rat. 10 out of 10 recommend. 10 out of 10, bro. Shout out to Famous, man. Y'all did good. Y'all did real good. That's about it. Those were the concerns that people really had. I, I guess the main concern was the rigidity of the wheel. Uh, whether it was going to break or bend. Whoa. Or was it going to be hard on your back and all that. Which is definitely hard on your back. You know, so... Don't be doing no bomb drops and shit like that in these wheels, but yeah, man, pretty solid wheel. Good shit, famous. Good shit. And uh, I guess we're just gonna do some tricks, man. I ain't bringing y'all here just to talk. Let's get to it. But until next time, homies, take it easy. What did you do today to save the world? <laughs>